Hey guys, what's up? Today we're going to open up a Lord of the Rings collection booster box here. Um, these are supposed to contain nothing but hits, I guess. 15 cards packed full of rares and foils. Um, these are go for about $40 to $45. I kind of want to see if they actually contain the same value in cards as what you paid. Let's crack this open, and it does say it can include a serializing ring card. I'm not 100% what those are... Like what those look like. Oh, here's a pull. Pack. We don't completely decimate this box. Yeah. Oh well. Oh, that's sweet looking though. The inside of it there. So basically, <laughs> that's kind of funny. This entire box, <laughs> just for one of these guys. I think that's all that's in there. It's a cool box, but kind of unnecessary for one little pack. Well, let's see what we get. All right. And then at the end of this video, I'll total up the value of the cards that I pulled and we can get an idea if it was worth it. So there's, oh wow. Okay, oh okay, this is one of those double-sided cards, double-sided foil. That's, that was throwing me off a little bit. So I guess all these are gonna be foil. I can hold these right. Oh, that's pretty cool. Foil land. I love these lands. Mithril coat. Okay. Oh, that's a, I love that card. Oh wow, that's pretty sweet looking. Ooh, Balrog Durin, Durin's Bane. I probably butchered that name. Okay, Pippin's Bravery. That's a foil. A, a foil. <laughs> and we've got Sauron the Necromancer. All right. Well, like I said, I'm gonna tally these up, see how much we got in value, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so I tallied up all the pulls that I got, and I got about $55 in uh, pulls in total. Uh, most of the cards were only like a few cents, but I had a couple big hitters. I'm going to list in the description every card and their value so you can get an idea because there was a couple. One was like a $25 card. I think another was about 10 or 15 So, but yeah, not bad, $55. I paid about $45, so it's not too bad. Um would I suggest buying buying them? <laughs> I mean, that's up to you. I thought it was pretty cool, but it is pretty expensive for 15 cards. But it might be one of those things to buy and just keep sealed. That might be the better bet. And it could spike in value later on when the set's no longer available. So, But yeah, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, do all that fun stuff. And I'll catch you in the next video. Later.